Okay, we're starting from the main menu. This will be a multi-tap saturation test. If you would like to see the connection of the CT, that is in the ratio video and the ratio section of the instruction manual. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to press saturate, low range, and multi. Sorry about that. Okay, multi, it is now uh, running the test. It is testing on tap X1. The LED is red because the red jack is connected. When it reaches the uh, saturation point under the word amps, the word sat will appear. Test for that tap is complete. It's running the variac down and plotting the graph. It is now saving the data to the flash drive. The little green light LED on the flash drive is flashing as it writes the data. Okay, it is now uh, testing tap X2. The blue light is on, indicating that the blue jack is energized. It is plotting the graph for uh, tap X2. And now it is saving the data to the flash drive. Okay, skipping ahead to the X3 tap. We just plotted the graph to the X3 tap, and uh, it is now saving that to the flash drive. The green light is on, indicating that the uh, X3 tap is energized. The green tap, green jack. Okay, erasing that, and now it will proceed to test tap X4. X4 saturates really quick, it's 200 to 5, so don't get a very good characteristic out of it, but boy it is. X4 is complete. X4 is being written to the flash drive. A little green light in the flash drive will flash while it's writing the data. Alright, now the test is now complete. So what remains to be done, if you want to uh, upload this to the server, is simply press FTP. It will say uploading, and the file name will appear below the buttons. There is a web func feature that allows the uh, automatic, these files to be automatically concatenated and placed in a database for creation of a data sheet then or at any time in the future. And that is the multi-tap saturation test. Okay, this will be a demonstration of the two-terminal secondary saturation test. Uh, it's connected 
just like the two terminal uh, ratio test, so I won't have a, a little a show and tell on the connection. You can watch the ratio movie and see how it's connected, and the connection is the same. Okay, I'm going to press saturate. I'm going to press low range, so I know it saturates below 200 volts. Turn the output on. See, it says the output on, and press auto. It says auto start. The voltage will increase, and it will take voltage and current data. When it reaches the saturation point, the word sat will, will appear under amps. CT has reached the saturation point. Now running the bariac down and uh, plotting the results on the screen. Of course I have to save them so I can press the save button and the uh, see it says disk save. The, the light on the flash drive is flashing and one way to tell if the flash drive is working properly is the green light should flash. If it's not, there's something wrong. The other method, of course, is to press the FTP key and upload it to the server where a web interface can uh, concatenate the files and put them in the database so you can recreate a data sheet either then or any time in the future. Thank you for watching.